Melbourne, how you going? I saw this t-shirt and it said, I'm not gay, but my boyfriend is. I didn't think it was funny. And I asked my girlfriend to take it off. I was an easygoing boyfriend though. I, one, one time she was spending the night and she said, Arj, I don't want to have sex tonight. And I said, that's fine, but may I ask why? Well, if you really want to know, Arj, it's that time of the month. I was like, look, I totally understand. I pay rent too. <laughs> that's a stressful. She's like, no, you idiot. I'm on my cycle. I was like, that's cool. You can leave it here. I'll give you a lift home. <laughs> so I'm single now. But I hate shopping. I had to buy a watch. You would think that would be easy, but they won't shut up about how far underwater they can go. This watch, 50,000 meters. Well, actually, I'm a land-dwelling mammal. 5,000 meters. I'm not a diver. 500 meters. I was like, look, I don't want to be rude, but if I'm ever more than three meters beneath the surface of the water's surface, I'm frickin' drowning. I don't care if my digital watch works anymore at that point. Because quite frankly, I'm not that demanding of a consumer. You know, I'm not like, oh, wonderful, I'm drowning. I wonder what time it is. Oh, could anything else go wrong today? The worst is buying shoes. Because there's like 70 million types of shoes. I don't know what kind of shoes I need. Welcome to the shoe store, Emporium Outlet, sir. What are you looking for? Are you looking for walking shoes? <laughs> well, I'd like to have that option. <laughs> Can you imagine having a pair of shoes you could only walk in? That could be limiting in certain situations. Everybody get out of here, there's a swarm of bees coming. Oh, great! I got my walking shoes on, man. I'm gonna stroll the hell out of here at a moderate pace. Ah, bees all over me. I can't go any faster. They're walking shoes and I'm flooring it. Thank you. Please welcome my favorite threesome, the Kransky Sisters. <laughs> 